It is Monday afternoon. It is Memorial Day. I have the day off work. Do a little barbecuing today, but I decided I wanted to clean out my building. Decided to rest a lot of yesterday after I got done with the race around 8, got home around 9, 9.30. Just kind of rested throughout the day. Didn't do too much. Then today, I was feeling kind of restless. I have been wanting to put another building, uh, another storage building back here in this corner next to this one but that meant i had to slide it down so since i had to slide it down i figured i had to clean it out level the ground i need to do a big cleaning and leveling over here in the corner so i'm probably gonna use some gravel to do that got this cleaned up i'm gonna pack it back up as neat as possible until i get the other building done but that is monday no training today just doing a little uh physical activity by working around the house It is Thursday morning. I am getting my first workout in, you know. Basically since the race last week, I've taken a few days off to recover, relax Memorial Day with the family. The last couple of days have not done anything. So now I'm headed to the track. It is four in the morning. Headed to the track to meet my buddy Mike, and we're gonna do Merv. So I did not get to do it since I was recovering on Memorial Day. It's a CrossFit style workout. We're gonna get in a one mile run. 100 pull-ups, 200 push-ups, 300 air squats, and another one mile run. I'm not gonna wear a vest this day, today. Uh, just going to do the workout, take it easy, because I am probably still doing some recovery. Don't wanna go out too hard, but doing something different this morning. In the water's nice, rock yourself a little slice, grab a backpack and lies, you never know we just go no, 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 we can't come close, come close. Got it for the low, 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 low. Wait it for the six, but it's going slow mo. Yeah, don't go, don't go. I just can't come close, come close. I'm looking for the low goal, low goal. No, I don't wanna postpone, postpone. Yeah, whip it, flip it. I just wanna get it. Going all in and I won't stop winning. Whip it, flip it. I just wanna get it. Let it all go and I won't stop winning no, I don't wanna hear about your front a Lot of bad stories coming out of one joint I met a true book in the state of my mind I don't know a lot of rookies coming over for the title But I don't wanna fight, I just roll the dice Do it for the money, yeah, do it for the price Take it like a man, no, I don't take advice Put the money on the table like a Russian with the spice We just go, no, 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 no It is Friday morning and I am in the garage gym this morning about to hit the rower and the bike and then do a little bit of lifting. I am sore today. Uh, it's only been 24 hours since doing Merv yesterday and, and I can tell my body was not in shape to do that many pull-ups, push-ups, and squats. I'm gonna get on here, work it out, then hit some weights. Nothing too heavy today, just some light weights. Keep the body moving. In the day, I am going to do a little net con, some light power cleans, along with some step ups with some dumbbells. I'm gonna do five power cleans and then five each leg, so 10 total step ups for four rounds.
of that. Oh, that is it for Friday's workout. That was hard. It wasn't very heavy weight, but it was hard. I'm not in real weightlifting shape, so just taking the weights light and uh, just getting the work in. Now it's Friday, so I've got work. Tonight is carnival at my daughter's school, so that'll be a lot of fun. And then over the weekend, I took my bike last night to get serviced because it wasn't quite shifting right and uh, needed to get some new tires and tubes, so I'm gonna pick that stuff up, get that changed, and then I'll be able to hit the road with the bike and get it back on the trainer. So right now I'm looking at some of the smart trainers just so that I can actually start to use Zwift. I don't know if any of you use Zwift, but if you do, let me know in the comments, let me know what you think. I'm looking at one of the Wahoo smart trainers, that way I can connect it and uh, actually control the, the wattage on the bike or the power, the resistance, um, just so I can enjoy riding the trainer a little more because my basic trainer, uh, I never enjoy riding the bike on the trainer just because it's really boring. So looking forward to getting Zwift on the TV back here and being able to do some workouts that way during the week because all of my riding is going to be 4.30 in the morning in the dark, so I don't really wanna be out on the roads riding at that time. I'm also hoping to get a swim in this weekend. The community pool in my old community is supposed to be heated, so with any luck, I'll be getting a swim in on Saturday or Sunday. trying out my coffee from Beanbox. Beanbox sent me a sampler pack of a bunch of coffees. Today I am doing the fundamental coffee. It is called the Humbucker Blend and uh, Beanbox offers coffee monthly deliveries. You can do sample boxes, you can send gifts. They've got a really great website. I'm excited to try all the different flavors and uh, it might be my solution. Right now I order coffee on Amazon monthly, but I'm really liking the pour over coffee. So uh, I always end up running out of beans and I don't have any. So I think Beanbox is the solution to that problem. So this one, the Humbucker Blend is, uh, they say this is a bold, spicy, herbal coffee. Uh, it's not too bad. I, uh, I don't mind it at all. So if you're interested, check out beanbox.com and uh, see all the stuff. I think they've got a new subscriber. It is Saturday morning. I am at the pool, gonna get a simple pool workout in. It's been over a year since I've been in the pool. So probably gonna do a thousand yards, maybe 1200, see how I feel once I get in there. I know I feel like I'll hit a bunch of laps, but then when you get in there, you realize, ah, yeah, mm, not really in swim shape. So gonna have to work on that. Simple 100s, 200s, 400s, things like that. Let's get to it. Well, that is it for the first workout. I ended up doing 2,000 yards. After I started swimming, I wanted to do a mile, which is about 1,760 yards. Then just ended up swimming, finish it out at 2,000. Felt really good, uh, tired. You know, I was doing hundreds basically, and on the last 25 of each hundred, I could feel that uh, my stroke started to struggle a little bit. I was uh, feeling it. 
So got some work to do to get back in pool shape, but it felt really good to be out here. The water is heated, feels really good because the pool temperature is warmer than the air temperature, which is always nice. I am headed to Home Depot to pick up some rocks because I'm gonna start leveling out the place for the new shed. I also just got a call from La Habra Cyclery. My bike is all tuned up, ready to roll. So I'm gonna go by, grab the bike. Tomorrow morning, plan is to hit the river trail with my buddy Johnny, get my first ride outdoors in, in a really, really long time. I can't even remember the last time I rode my bike on the road. Oh, Well, the building is built and the wife is doing a bunch of baking for the Girl Scout event, the bridging event tomorrow. Emmeline is becoming a brownie, moving from a daisy to a brownie. So there are all kinds of cool little rainbow cupcakes being made. The girls are playing in the box that the building came in. Now I need to design some Girl Scout certificates in Illustrator to give to the girls at the ceremony. This right here is a box from Koros. They sent it to me yesterday. UPS got here today. It is a pre-release of their brand new watch for me to test out, try out, let you guys know what I think, give them some feedback. Let's open this up. We'll get a sneak peek and I'll do more on it later. This is pretty sweet. Oh, all right. I don't know if I can get into all this right now. We're gonna have to do this a little later. It is Sunday morning and with some last minute scheduling changes and some conflicts, I am headed to the park this morning to claim the spot for the Girl Scout ceremony. So no workout after all. I was hoping to get a bike ride in Got my bike back yesterday. Maybe I can get it on the trainer later today and at least get some spinning in. Or maybe if I get the spot at the park claimed and everything's set up, get a little workout in at the park. That bridge is heavier, heavier than it looks. Whew. Now, time to put it together. Well, I am all done setting up. It is 7.45, waiting for 
the people that are going to decorate to show up. So probably have at least an hour. So I'm gonna do some laps around the park, see how far it is to run. The loop is 0.3 miles. So I think I'm gonna do two loops, do some sort of body weight workout movement, then two more loops and repeat until I don't wanna do it anymore. three miles every half mile or every 0.6 miles about I did a set of body weight exercises 15 reps each Whew, my eyes are sweating It is Sunday evening, the week is over, the Girl Scout event went great. My wife and Angela put together an amazing event and the girls loved it. Got all that tore down, got a bunch of my tools loaded in my building and I have been cleaning out the gym and the garage. The bike is on my trainer. I'll be able to hit that this week. I actually ordered a smart trainer from Wahoo, got the Kicker Core. So I can actually connect it to Zwift and start training that way. Most of my bike training is going to be on the trainer in the morning, in the dark. So hopefully I'll get one ride in on the weekends. Uh, I've been cleaning this whole area out, trying to make room over here. It is a never ending job chore to keep my garage clean. I love keeping it clean, but it also for everyone else in the family becomes a dumping ground. If you know what I'm saying? So I work really hard to keep it clean because I enjoy being out here. I like training. I don't want to have to come out here, clean it up every time I want to train in the morning. And it just feels so much better when I'm training in a garage that looks really good. Hope you guys had a great week. Just took the girls out for a spin in the Mustang. Went out, we got a gas in it, and uh, we're done. We're just hanging out. Gonna watch a movie, gonna have some dinner. The week is over. I hope you guys had a great week. This was a good week for me, you know? I got some training in, got a little bit of recovery after last week's race. I was, uh, needed some rest Monday, Tuesday, so felt good just relaxing not doing much but now i'm feeling really good i'm ready to get into a full week of training next week i hope you guys had a great week thank you so much for the views the subscriptions the thumbs up the comments ah, keeps me motivated all of you guys that uh you left me a note about the race and uh basically uh saying it's okay or uh, good job and you know all of those things i really 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 appreciate it i'm a little behind on getting back on comments just a lot going on but as always thank you so much i am so grateful i will talk to you guys next week I'm gonna hit a swim workout today, get probably at least 1,000 to 12,000, 12,000, 1,200.